But yeah, we would try to understand the distance metrics are a key part of several machine learning algorithms, right? Uh, what I'm talking, there are different machine learning algorithms, but distance metrics are part of them, right? So these distance metrics are used. I mean, it is used in both supervised as well as unsupervised learning. So I will let you clear what is supervised, what is unsupervised later on. But just now keep in mind that these distance metrics are used in both supervised and unsupervised as well generally to calculate the similarity between the data points. So why it is used to calculate the similarity between the data points. Data points will have the similarity as well to identify that, that. For example, there are two mobile phones. Yeah. So yeah, you have a two mobile phone. So are these two mobile phones are similar or not? Or if you and your friend, how much you are similar or not? And what are the characteristics common in both of you? So that's why uh, distance metrics are used to find out the similarity between two objects as well. What is the object? It could be anything like you, like pen, uh, likes any product between two uh, YouTube videos, right? Yeah, you, you know, when you watch a one video, you are recommended another video by YouTube. But how? Because what video you have watched? So they try to find out the similar another video. And in that case, distance metrics are used to find out the similarity between the watch video and which will be recommended to you that video. Well, another <clears throat> common example, let's say if you want to uh, create a cluster, uh, later uh, you will be uh, taught the different clustering algorithm like a K-means clustering, k rs algorithm. But keep in mind that <clears throat> to make a cluster, uh, then distance metrics are used. Uh, if we tell that if you want to make a, a group among the students, usually how you make a group? Obviously, you make a group with your known person or you just uh, take someone which is very closer to you. That means you find the similarity uh, with the other person and you pick them, right? <coughs> well, so yeah, there are different similarity metrics or there are, uh, sorry, I'm talking about that there are different uh, distance metrics in machine learning. The most common metrics are Euclidean distance, Manhattan distance, Minkowski, Humming distance, and uh, cosine, you know, the Chebyshev distance, Jacquard coefficient, Humming distance, and Jacquard index as well. So these are the, so we will actually I study on those distance metrics one by one. Earlier, if you look at the figure, what you can see, uh, because uh, this is a similar, because they are very close to each other. And these figures, they are not the similar because they are not very close to each other. They are actually not similar. They are very close to each other. They are actually not similar. They are actually similar. They are actually dissimilar. Right? So, our similarity, that means you can understand that dissimilarity as well. So dissimilarity is you know, So uh, now let's start with Euclidean distance. So what is Euclidean distance? This is, this is basically your uh, distance matrix, right? So let's start with Euclidean distance. So Euclidean distance calculate the distance between two real value vectors, right? But it is most popular distance matrix as well in machine learning algorithm. But the question is that uh, why it is used? Already you got the idea uh, why it is used. So in real life distance measuring, I'm going to use for the body. And the shortest path by length, I'm going to measure for the second number to use for the body. So it can be used over there. Now, yeah, uh, in this graph, what you can, if you look at this graph, you understand that. And it is very clear to you. Uh, the one point is like uh, here. And the other point is B. So A among B A distance to be called your number Euclidean distance that we use for the body. So you can understand this is your X1 and this is your Y1. This is your Y2, this is your X2. Right? So here you can understand the what I'm saying. 
x1 and x2. Well, now what is the formula? So to find out the equilibrium distance, there is a formula. So everyone just noted down the formula. So we have the formula to leak it. So dear, the formula is like a d. d it means the distance. Eh? D there is distance k mean for the total d equal to x2 minus x1 whole square. You noted down the formula plus y2 minus y1 whole square. Right? This is the formula to find out the distance. Now, if you have a two point, for example, this is the one two point. Thake, j, at a point below A, 3, 2. The other point is B, 4, 1. So the, my question is that, here 3 is what? 3 means x1. Or 2 means y1. y1. Is it clear to you? So yes, everyone sir. just note copy down. So wait a little And let's do calculation with me. So suppose now d equal to according to the formula, what is the x2? x2 is 4. Minus what is the x1? x1 is 3. So 4 minus 3 is so plus. What is y2? <coughs> y2 Sir. is 1. Y1 is 2. 2. So now you do the calculation. Uh, so minus 1. So root 2. So 1 is square means 1 plus. So to minus 1 into minus 1 is plus 1. So minus 1 into minus 1. Plus 1. Root plus 1. So the answer is root 2. So what is the value? Can anyone find the value? Sir, 1.4142. 1.41. Okay, fine. Oh, fine. 1.41. So this this is the value. The whole A and B are Sir, this is the point. Sir, when two point, then x2 minus x1 is equal to three point. Three point. Then what happens? 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 A will look 3, 2, let's say 4. Yeah. And B will look 4, 1, let's say 6. So, how much is for A for more to leave? But, just to be so, 4 minus 3 whole square plus 1 minus 2 whole square plus. We talk about X1, X2, X3. Yeah? Plus. Y1 minus. Uh, uh, 6 one minus. Z3 minus Z2 Y2 Kimba. Nah, Igula shop ke one bolo to sorry e, X2 Tabone Z1 minus Z2. Yeah. Same, it remains same. Jaya shuk, jaya shuk, eh? So I have this note. Tomo shabaki ra kore chha. Yes, sir. Okay, fine. Akon, you will find the other exercise over here. You can add up exercise as a deal. This is another exercise. Two minus one. So, a eta the Euclidean distance apply kore to me because research the catch of the bar. Among already on the research the bar came to it a use way. Research the high above will see. Among real life with use which is it umbra as before it. Uh, research. I am not sure about the research. I am not sure about the research. I am not sure about the research. I am not sure research. I am not sure about the 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 
देखते so let's discuss about it manhattan distance uh, basically is the sum of absolute difference between point across all the dimension what do you mean by that the absolute difference mean holo je amra age jeta korechi shudhu ekhane absolute ta amra use korchi the manhattan distance also called the taxi cab distance or the city block distance and it is like a similar so it calculates the distance between two real valued vector it's like a previous when age ja bolchi tai if you look at the formula then it is very clear to you dekho ekhane ki bolchi amra x2 minus x1 plus y2 minus y1 but the formula is a little bit different formula ta ki different ekhane formula ta holo all of you just note it down amra shudhu shobai kaaj ta kori ekhane formula ta holo d equal to सर मैनहटन नेक्स्ट डिस्टेंस एट एक्चुअल कास्ट है कि सर बोलते हैं ये तो किंतु तुम्हार डिस्टेंस से बेर करे बट ये डिस्टेंस बेर करा था एब्सोल्यूट बेल उठा नहीं थे ओके प्लस हम लोग ये एक ना किंतु डिस्टेंस बेर करो अनेक गुलाब पिक्चर्स चीज़ बो एक पर हम लोग बोल बो कौन-कौन डिविजन শুধু এখানে কি আমরা অ্যাবসলিউটে ইউজ করেছি আর ওখানে স্কয়ার রুট ছিল এখানে স্কয়ার রুট নেই তাহলে আমরা অ্যাবসলিউট ভ্যালুটা এখানে নিব তো এখন আমরা যদি এ হয় 1 4 এন্ড বি হয় 0 3 ওকে ফাইন সো ইউ তাহলে আমরা এখানে কি বলতে পারি x2 হোয়াট ইজ x2 x2 ইজ 0 আবার ওই সেট হলো x1 y1 y2 sorry x2 y2 x2 y2 so amader x1 hocche 1 na sorry ji sir 1 nahi sir x2 sorry x2 minus x2 minus x1 tale x2 hocche 0 look at the b points Zero minus one. Zero minus one. Point that sir, if couple of x do any reason, x one, x two, x three, if we have couple of y do any, y one, y two, y three, y four, then only sir, out could be easy. Now, if sir x y z, only. Okay, no, no, no problem. You mean that only problem? That you define could be done. Okay, no problem. 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 Also, well, yeah. So let's move on. I can remember y two. Our other y two is equal to three. Three minus y one. Y one is four. Four sir. So now we're going to calculate. So we're going to do minus one plus minus one. Plus minus one. Here we add one. So we're going to absolute value. Here we're going to find out. So one plus one is so equal to two. So this is the value of the Manhattan. So All of you just note it down. So by the coro, hey, coro is also by. Well, yeah. So these are the. Ekho namra, jodi bolii, the Manhattan distance niye Manhattan er application dekhena the awas implementation kiwa be korbe tumra ha. Amra implementation ke. Jeto hobe Python ta ekono jai ni se jine tenia ra ekono dekhchi namra coro abar ajo. Abi lo dekhu gita bol link da awas ek korbe tumra dekhni the paro jai ni. So let's talk about the the new thing that is the Minkowski distance. Now we are talking about the Minkowski distance. Well, yeah, mean quest distance 
or Minkowski matrix, whatever to Jai Bolo, is a non vector space which can be considered as a generalization of both the Euclidean distance. Actually, can Euclidean both see? Karon, uh, it can a Manhattan among Euclidean at a form to Michel Pave. Also, it is the name after the German mathematical Harman Minkowski. When Unan Name, Unan Namcha Harman Minkowski, second the Minkowski number the way. So, well, Minkowski distance is the generalized, I mean, generalized form of Euclidean and Manhattan distance. So, Euclidean and Manhattan are a form of kind of these. So, let's see. Uh, Manhattan and Euclidean are a kind of these. Okay, sir. I just wrote it down. Okay, 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 I just wrote आर मैनहटन ने एब्सुलेट चला अपने एब्सुलेट तो दिए थे आर एक ने हेज चीज़ करी थी व्हाट इस हेज आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस सर जो तो गुला पॉइंट्स थक गए डेटा पॉइंट थक गए शेटा होच्छ हेज हैं वाई टू माइनस वाई वन दें प्लस एवं बार चलते थक गए जो तो गुला थक एर पर एक है ना आर एक टा व्हाट इस हेज then it is actually the Manhattan distance. The H equal to, if H equal to one, then it is man, say, Manhattan, it's Manhattan distance. Among Jodi H equal to two hour, then it is Euclidean distance. When Euclidean distance can all see, it will be able to type power. Euclidean will only be able to type power. Among it, it will be able to type power. Uh, the form of distance called the Elfin knob. It is called the Elfin knob. Sir, what is the calculate of this? Sir, H is given. Here, H is given. What is the calculate of this? Usually, one to one is available. You can see the different ones. Sir, one to two is normal integer. Three is the different value. Different value as well. Different values. Different values. Well, the according to the formula, the number of the peer value 3 or H3 is the same. Again, I am writing down the formula. Formula to do like equal to formula to do like d equal to someone again tell me x two minus x two minus x two minus x one x one modulus of h y two minus minus y one modulus of h. Well, I can only do this. I h will be like that three that was h will be like that. Three, so it is three, and then you x two minus x one. That means one minus two. Sir, eight at the h shell value three does. I give us a two or one hole, and one hole may not or what's a two hole intelligence. It's a key of it, but three will be a different value as well. One of two is a number syllable. So, I like any key of it, two minus one. ओ अच्छा इकने इकने एक तो इंटरेस्टिंग जिम्मेदारी देखो आमी आमार आगे न्यू में कोल ले आर इकने आवर एक तो बिन्नो करी जो वन माइनस टू लगी था इसलिए ना एक ही हो गया क्या ना एक ही हो गया गुस्ते पर जोगन एफ्सुलेट आते तो अपन एफ्सुलेट आते इसलिए जो मतलब प्रामे आगे शोभा की आवृत्ति हो गई। ये तो ये बुस्त करें सी। यार हे चीज़ थी। जी सर। हे चीज़ कल्टर थ्री। 
So they are two minus one means k one. One minus zero means one. Zero minus two means k minus two three. So if there are one plus one plus minus two, then two is a absolute, right? Yeah. देखो प्लस टू है जब इज द रेजल्ट रिमेन्स से सिमिलर क्वेश्चन बुजे মানে আমি বলতেছি কি স্যার মানুষ যে এরকম চিন্তা করে যে এই মুভিটা রোমান্টিক এই মুভিটা হরর এরকম টাইপের মুভি তাকে হ্যাঁ সে তার কাছে মেশিন কি করে বুঝতেছে এটা হরর কিংবা এটা রোমান্টিক এরকম যখন মুভিটা এন্ট্রি দেওয়া হয় হ্যাঁ তখন তো মুভি ক্যাটাগরি দেওয়া হয় না কোন টাইপের মুভি কি মুভি আমাদের সার্চ আমাদের সার্চ কিওয়ার্ডের উপরও স্যার আমাদের উপর রিকমেন্ড আছে সেটা তো আছে তারপরে এই কোসাইন সিমুলেটর দিয়ে এখানে আসলে কি এক্স ওয়ান এক্স টু তে একটা প্যারামিটার এভাবে তোমার অনেকগুলো প্যারামিটার থাকবে যে রোমান্টিক মুভি লেন্থ কি মুভিটা কোন ক্যাটাগরিতে পড়ে এটা কি চাইল্ড মুভি অনেক করে এর পরে এই সিমিলারিটি ম্যাট্রিক্স গুলো अप्लाई করে দেখা হয় যে সিমিলার ম্যাট্রিক্স কার এখানে এই যে টি কিউ বলছি বা এক্স ওয়ান এক্স টু বলছি এগুলো তো একটা অ্যাট্রিবিউট কার অ্যাট্রিবিউট কোন একটা অবজেক্টের অ্যাট্রিবিউট লাইক এটা মুভি এটা বুক হ্যাঁ এটা গ্যাজেট এখন কি হয় সংসদ জি স্যার মানে আমরা যে ক্যাটাগরিটা দিই সেই ক্যাটাগরির উপর বেস করে সে নাই আর কিছু অনেকগুলো ফ্যাক্টর আছে যেগুলো আরো সামনে বলবো সেটা হলো আরেকটা হলো তোমার সাথে একজন ইউজার যদি সিমিলারিটি পায় তাহলে সেই ইউজার যা দেখে তোমাকে তারই কমেন্ট করে আবার কি করে ফিডব্যাক তুমি কোনটাতে কেমন ফিডব্যাক দিয়েছো সেগুলো নিয়ে হিসাব করে देयर আর মেনি টেকনিক্স তুমি যদি একটা মুভি দেখেছো কিন্তু তুমি খুব নেগেটিভ ফিডব্যাক দিয়েছো তাহলে ওই সিমিলার মুভি তো তোমাকে তোমার কি ইউ আর নট ইন্টারেস্টেড এবং ওই মুভিটি দেখে বুঝবে তুমি কোন কারণে ইন্টারেস্টেড না কি মুভির কারণে না এই ধরনের মুভি তোমার ভালো লাগে না হোয়াট ইজ দ্য রিজন সো এটা আরো কিছু ইন্টার যেমন আমরা সেন্টিমেন্ট অ্যানালাইসিস করি এই সেমিস্টারে অনেকগুলো স্টুডেন্ট এই রিসার্চ করতেছে বিশেষ করে সেন্টিমেন্ট অ্যানালাইসিস যে কোন একটা রিভিউ থেকে ক্লায়েন্ট কে বোঝা বা ইউজার কে বোঝা যে সে কি এটা পজিটিভ নিয়েছে নেগেটিভলি নিয়েছে না সে মানে নট নেগেটিভ নট পজিটিভ মোটামুটি Well, yeah. So let's start with the cosine similarity. You know the cosine similarity again. Uh, 
is a measure of similarity between two non-zero vectors. Well, so already I told you there are some real-life example of Poisson similarity. So, but the mathematical discussion is like that. If two vectors are P and Q, if you have a two vectors, or could be A and B, whatever the name, P and Q, this is the symbolic name, the angle between them is theta. Then the relation between the angle and vectors are the following. That means if you have a two vectors, P and Q, so the angle indicates that how much they are similar. So if the angle, for example, if I show you, if the angle is here, so the one calculation, if the angle is here, then is the another calculation. So the angle indicates that how much they are similar, right? So the formula is this cos theta equal to cos theta equal to p vector dot product q vector divided by double epsilon. Oh, what is the name? Double epsilon. Can you tell me the name? What it is called? Anyone else? Sir, magnitude. 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 This is called the magnitude vector. Uh, very good. So, the magnitude of Euclidean distance, Suppose it will be able to do it. Suppose it will be able to do it. P magnitude take you away formula. P1 is square, jo P2 is square, plus P3, something like this. Similarly, Q, magnitude of Q, Q is very good. P is very P is Q is very good. P 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 and Q to the P I dot Q I actually P I Q I summation of P I Q I Tamaniki I P one Q one plus P two Q two plus P three Q three that is the no no I can hold this this is the formula how to find the P and Q well yeah so I'm reckon to the according to the formula I'm going to be quickly Okay, we have our two point. I want to do the point at the point of looking noted down P the picture of one zero one and Q to our photo zero one from one. So our P and Q given the law of the first key will put the way PQ. How can I calculate it? Tell me, P1, Q1, one into zero. Sorry, one into zero. Plus, P2Q. Huh? P2, Q2, Q2, P2, Q2, 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 so it is a result one. So the PQ pagan. Economic key very good to be. I can very good to be a mother key. Magnitude of P. Rekiba very good. P1 is square money one. One is square plus P2 is square means zero is square plus P3 is square means one is square. So how is it? One plus zero plus one. So it's square root of two. Similarly, magnitude of Q Q1 square Q2 square zero one Q2 square one plus Q3 square one square. So square root of two. Again two then two holes. The reckon according to the formula of the Boshi will key that the formula key cos theta equal to P vector dot Q vector divided by magnitude of P into magnitude of Q. So you pay a sum of 
So P factor Q vector kotha hai. Tadar four akta. Ito hula hai kotha. One. One. Divided by magnitude of P kotha square root two into square root two Q. Q to two two. Ida ko one kotha the gaya se. Ekhon the gaya se. Aar ek two arse kotha the gaya ekhon the gaya. Ek two arse ekhon the gaya. So tum jee ekhon dar karo ki dar abe. Calculation ko lekar mandar kotha se. One by two. One by two half. One by asole ki dar abe square root of four. So four mani. Two square, square root of category, that one by two. So that our example will be like cos theta equal to that all over to one by two. That is why we have to say theta equal to cos inverse one by two. That is, it is one by two. What degree is it? Cos inverse half. Sixty degrees. Sixty degree. That is why we have to say that sixty degree is. ताली 60 डिग्री होते एक है ना होगे, ठीक ना? सो तारा किचुड़ा सिमिलर, तारा की किचुड़ा सिमिलर, जो दी 90 डिग्री होता ली क्यों होगे? तारा तो कॉम सिमिलर, आप जो दी लाइक इफ इट इसे 160 डिग्री, तमन की, दे आर नॉट सिमिलर, तमन डिग्री जो तो बार बे तादेस सिमिलरिटी की तो तो बोलो सिमिलर क्यों हो गए कॉम के सर कॉम में बढ़िया सो दिस इज़ ऑल अबाउट द कोसेंसिमिलेटी